Today we're making this lovely pink drink. And with some special ginger, ginger syrup. I made that myself. Handmade. Handmade. Handcrafted. I squeezed it. Artisan. <laughs> Watch. Artisan, love that word. <laughs> Welcome to Combat Cocktails. Dan and Derek. Here, Ian's not here this month. Just like no. you know. If you didn't catch it already, now you know. If you didn't catch that, we're missing. Yeah. Something. The guy with the bar thing. Yeah. And he's all dressed up. Uh, he's on vacation. Yeah. Plays the part. He, he's on vacation because he, he wanted to take the week, the month off because he just needed some time. He gets paid for it and everything. Nobody gets paid. Um, <laughs> today, gets paid. we're going to make the fifth in Adams. This drink was submitted by uh, John Spikes. It seemed like it was a fitting cocktail. It had the bitters. It had some mezcal. Um, and it kind of ended up like the drink we did with Jennifer, uh, the last drink we did, the mezcal, pomegranate mezcal margarita. But this was actually in the recipe books first. And it's going to be ounce and a half. Oh, you know it? Oh, ounce and a half of yep. mezcal. An ounce of pineapple. Three quarter ginger syrup. Just made by Derek. Yeah, I did. You can have him come over your house. He'll make it for you. It's easy. Half ounce of lemon juice. Two dashes of Peychaud's. Yep. No float. Just put it right in there. Don't be afraid. <laughs> I don't want to make that mistake again. <laughs> sometimes you float your bitters. Sometimes yeah, you eat, sometimes you don't. Them, depending on what you're looking for. Um, these are obviously available at ozdrace.com. You can use the coupon code BITTERS to save yourself 15%. Well, you buy all your stuff at Ozdrace. I wouldn't stop with just yeah. Peychaud. I would go with like a different style of bitters. Either maybe a Serrano or a Firewater bitters. If you watch this month's episodes, here's what you're going to need. You're going to need Fee Brothers uh, Oak Age bitters. You're going to need Peychaud. You're going to need... Uh, what else? Cardamom from Scrappies, Firewater from Scrappies, and you've got yourself enough that you're probably going to get free shipping. And didn't you just get new bitters? Oh, yeah, I did. Uh, yes. What new bitters did you get? Well, uh, not, not new, but I, people have been asking me forever for these. And what happens is uh, the Bitter Cube Trinity bitters are out of stock. Yeah. They're great for pretty much every drink. Um, old fashions to gin based drinks. So, citrus, it's got uh, vanilla, cherry vanilla, bark, and orange in it. So, these are out of stock. The problem is I don't like to order just one like case of bitters because yeah. the companies get angry with you. Like, what do you mean? You maybe pack one case? <laughs> so I bought, I waited until I was running low. So if you needed to try any of the Bitter Cube, we have the sampler packs and stuff like that in stock. All of their products are in stock now. So you can get them all. And you don't have to ask They're great me. things to have. Yes. Especially the because I pumped these up for years. And then I sell out. And that's when everybody's like, where are your bitters? I'm like, damn it. You know what would be awesome? You want a, a glass? Is if I went to awesomedrinks.com and I got a glass that I could use right now. Like a... That would be amazing. A chilled coupe? Yes. That would be great. It's not chilled. <laughs> but it's oh, a coupe. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> now it's ready to go. Um, so basically, pour everything into your shaker and shake it. Use that. Use my, use my special design stuff. I did. So... To make, to make the ginger simple syrup, the recipe is really easy. Make simple syrup and then put the ginger in when it's done and let it steep for like 30 minutes. That was probably more like an hour because it just wasn't gingery enough for me. So I wanted, it's not hot, but I wanted that ginger flavor. Yeah. From a mezcal perspective, for this episode, we're using Durango uh, Mezcal Leanda, which is by far probably, if I had, a, if I had to go to a, a desert island and I only had one mezcal to choose from, it would be that. that would it be one. this one? Yeah. I'll 100%. see that? 100%. Me and Jen picked that up before the show, because <laughs> we know what we're doing. <laughs> now, this one's gone. That was a seventy-nine dollar bottle of Pesca. Who drank all that? I don't know. That's maybe, ridiculous. Maybe us. Oh, Never. Like the color it looks very classy. It does. It's got that peach like look to it. It's good. the pineapple always gives it that little foam mm -hmm. on top. Yeah. Always looks good. Yes, it does. I'm really looking for that, the ginger. Not really getting a lot of ginger though. Nope. That's probably there. And it'd be hard with the pineapple and the peychaud. Mm. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> it's not as smoky. It's a little smoky. I mean, it's really easy to drink. Mm. The only way you know that there's alcohol in there is it's because it's smoky. That's true. Other than that, you can't taste. Mm. That could be dangerous. It's a little salty. I get, the, I get the pineapple, the smoky pineapple, which is always good. Like mm. Smoky pineapple, we can't go wrong. It's like yeah. a, it's like a ham. <laughs> the, 
This is like a ham. <laughs> little smoky pineapples. Yeah, always smoky good. Pineapple. Yeah, the ginger doesn't come out. No. There's a little bit in the tail end, but mm. it's not... Although I did have a spicy drink not too long ago, so... <laughs> it's not spicy. I wonder who made that. It's not spicy like that. Like, we didn't just throw a half a million skull ball in here, but... Uh, it's got... It's delicate. It's not a very bold drink that has, like, crazy flavor. No, it's, it's really... smoky pineapple. It is smoky pineapple. The pay shots don't even really do much. You give it color. They probably do. Yeah, if you I take them out... Yeah, probably if we take Everything them out. gets weird when you start taking... Like, there's a synergy of these yeah. different type of flavors, and this is the type of drink where you're not getting phases of different flavor. It's just a drink with that flavor. I mean, it's pretty well balanced. It's, I mean, yeah. it's a really good drink. It's an, if you want a mezcal drink, and you've never drank mezcal before, this is a super easy drink. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because it's, it's to not. To use it in. And it's, it's not too smoky. Like, it's not too smoky and bold with lots of different crazy flavors. It's yeah. easy and delicate. This is like the type of drink that, and it, probably the case with, uh, this was, this is done by um, Ori Menash, I think. Or There's a whole list of people that, if you Google for Fifth and Adams, you'll probably find this specific drink. Um, this was on, oh, it was a book from Amazon.com. He links yeah. in, in the book that it came from. I'll see if I can link the book below as well. But it's, this is like one of those how, kind of house recipes. I I feel like I would really want it to be bigger. Like it's so you easy You know what, to if drink. it had some like, it's really easy to drink. I feel like I need more, like, I'm gonna drink that in like five seconds. Yeah, that you're really, I don't know. That's what, what I'm saying, like, like you want an intro drink to yeah. mezcal? Because yeah, it's not, it's not massively mm. exciting. It's just a very delicate, like introduction yeah. to gin or into introduction to mezcal. Yeah, it's got everything you need without going over the, over the top. It's not bitter. It's not. I'm just using that too spice. sweet. No. Um, a little hint of ginger would spice it up a little bit. I know ginger bitters. I don't have any of those. Mm. I don't even sell any. So ginger bitters don't exist to me. But I think that ginger, or ginger bitters don't exist. Maybe yeah, something that kind of bring out the the spice. It could just be because the last drink we had was very bold and exciting from a flavor perspective. Like it just hits you. Yeah, it's that's like a true. Train. Um, where this is like the opposite take on that. This is like hey, but that's easy. That's just nice, summertime. Oh yeah, I'm telling you, I would want that if I had. You okay. make that a batch. You are yeah. plowing that time. If I had <laughs> the most expensive thing ever, but <laughs> if, like this is this is a this why, is a sixteen dollar drink, right? But I would rather have this in in a in a in a glass like this. Oh, with some ice. <laughs> yeah, like, oh yeah. Boom. boom. The problem is you just suck that down in two seconds. And it's an ounce and a half, right? Yeah. So this is going to be what, like a six ounce drink of yeah. alcohol, right? You're going to have one of these at the poolside, and you're going to fall in the pool, and you're dead. But I would That's enjoy okay. it better if I had yeah. more of it because it's just too easy to drink in a yeah. tiny glass like that. Um, also, don't forget to subscribe to the show because obviously you want to do that. It's awesome. It's smoky aftertaste. Uh, like this video because that's what you should do. I gave you your coupon code, so you've got that. Our executive producer is actually Vodka Brands Corporation or Vodka Brands Corp. I, bo I don't know if that means they have a YouTube channel, but search Vodka Brands Corp in YouTube to find their specific username if you want to. But they joined us and pay five bucks a month to become a Common Man Cocktails Damn. channel subscriber thing. Member. Member. CMC member. So you hit the little blue join button. Boom! You joined. And like, it's like all happy. Yeah. You see dance face every like, day. Oh, sh shit. <laughs> That's gotta be awesome. Just like Diana did. And she had her credit in her a couple videos ago. So you got that going for you. Um, sidebar. Let's do some Mezcal drinks. Mezcal playlist in the sidebar. Do it. And then something else that you're gonna enjoy. I just don't know what it is yet. You'll love it. Um, down below, bartender starter kit, where you can get the bartender starter kit from allstreaks.com. Get your Trinity emitters, get your patio emitters, all your stuff all at once. Spend over 100 bucks. Free shipping for you in the United States. Because I only ship in the United States. <laughs> Teach you how to drink.